I'm, I'm so <laughs> about <Hello>, Bella. No. <laughs> Come on, West Indian people. 
Because I didn't feel too good about that. I want to feel like I'm Eddie Murphy, Chris Rock, and Kevin Hart mixed together in a beef blood clot party. You dig? So I'm going to reintroduce myself. I'm going to turn around and act like I wasn't here. And we're going to start this shit over. I want to have an orgasm when y'all introduce me tonight. Fuck out of here. I got two flags, nigga. Puerto Rican flag and a Haitian flag. I and I'm gonna explain to you why later. Let me go backstage. Coming to the stage, ladies and gentlemen, he did this show called Video Music Box for 27 years. He's got his own TV show on Amazon Prime, 32 episodes deep, Laughaholics Live. He's opening his own comedy club on Washington, in Park Avenue, 200 motherfucking seats in November. Put your hands together for the host of the Stand Up and Die Major Hype Comedy Tour, Ray Dijon. So you said, he been doing shit for 80 years in New York. I'm like, God damn. But he's right. I took three naps before I came to this bitch tonight. Just so I could hang out with y'all motherfuckers. I'm on cocaine and Red Bull right now just to stay the fuck up. <laughs> that's, what's, that's what I'm doing, man. I just hit 60 years old in July, y'all. Clap it up for me. Yeah. And my dick still works. Son of a bitch! I'm a happy nigga. I'm happier than a motherfucker. We're gonna have a good time today. Major Hype is a good friend of mine. I go way, way back with him. This is the Stand Up and Die comedy tour presented by Major Hype. Make some noise in the building. How many West Indians we got that are from out of town that are here for the Labor Week, Labor Day weekend celebration? Make some noise. If you're sitting there, somebody from Brooklyn, please make sure you put your pocketbook underneath and hire some blood clot security. <laughs> We're definitely going to have a good time. We have a variety of comedians. Of course, Major Hype is going to shut this shit down at the end, but I'm your host. I'll be coming back and forth. I see a couple of late people. I see somebody that took a shit in the bathroom. Maybe they told me. The nigga got on white Adidas, so look at the person <laughs> next to you. <laughs> Ain't nothing wrong with being old, ladies and gentlemen. It's nothing wrong with being, I, I've embraced my older age. I get mad discounts and benefits. <laughs> fuck out of here. I went to Foot Locker to buy some sneakers. They said $79.99. I said, fuck out of here. I pulled out my AARP platinum card. <laughs> I pulled out my Accessoride Uber membership. Pulled out my life alert button. I said, how much for the sneakers? They said, nigga, we owe you 24 now. <laughs> Fuck out the store. We're going to have some fun. That's my man S1 from WBLS. That's his son. That's his son over there. Also, Cedric the Entertainer's son. Clap it up for that, nigga. We got a great show. We're going to start it off. 
gonna do the ladies up front because it's ladies first that we're gonna progress into some of the male comedians. But every single comedian on the show has their different perspective in comedy. We're gonna respect these comedian and we're gonna make sure that we bring them up with a tremendous round of applause celebrating West Indian heritage this weekend in Brooklyn, New York. What more than a better place? Eastern Parkway, New York City. We're here tonight. Major hype, stand up and die tour. Let me bring up the first comedian coming to the stage, a female that is from Brooklyn, New York. She's gonna break this shit wide open. Please put your hands together for Young Tef. Let's go.